The Headless Horseman is a legendary character that in many ways has become a part of America's rich Halloween tradition. But where did this story come from? In 1820, American author Washington Irving wrote a short story titled The Legend of Sleepy Hollow. The story was based on an old German folktale, and it featured a character from Terrytown named Ichabod Crane, a bony, lanky, and superstitious schoolmaster. Throughout the story, he is competing with Brom Bones for the affections of a young woman named Katrina Van Tassel, the only child of an extremely wealthy farmer. As Ichabod leaves a party at the Van Tassel home one autumn night, he is relentlessly pursued across the countryside by the headless horseman. The horseman is believed to be the ghost of a German Hessian soldier who had fought in the Revolutionary War and had lost his head when it was shot off by a cannonball. According to the area legend, the unfortunate soldier was then compelled to ride into battle every night in search of his missing head. In most modern variations and depictions of the story, the horseman is usually portrayed holding a jack-o'-lantern in place of his head. After being chased by the headless horseman, Ichabod disappears from the town forever, never to be seen again. Katrina is left behind, eventually wedding Brom Bones. While the story is left open to the reader to make their own interpretation, it is strongly suggested that the Headless Horseman was not a ghost at all, but actually Brom Bones in disguise. The Legend of Sleepy Hollow is one of the classic examples of early American fiction and is still enjoyed by countless people today. The story has been told and retold countless times and has been presented in many different forms, from animated television specials to big budget motion pictures and even live stage performances. The Headless Horseman will almost certainly continue his ride through American culture into the 21st century and endure as a part of the American Halloween tradition.